Let's open more rolls of nickels for the hunt and fill. If you haven't seen the last episode, near the end of it, we got a buffalo nickel. We got 1961, Denver. We got 1964, Philadelphia. We got a 1960, Denver. We got a reverse Denver. That's a 1964. What's this one? We got a 1970 San Francisco. The back is very damaged though. I saw this coin in the middle of the roll. It looks a lot older and it's a reverse Denver. It's a 1957. We have another one that looks older. It's a 1964. We have another Buffalo nickel in the roll. This one might actually have a date. This one I'm looking at under the scope. That three looks kind of big, so I don't think it's a three. I don't know what that is. Is there a mint mark on it, though? No. There's no mint mark there. Well, I don't think that's a mint mark. You should be able to see a mint mark if it was on there. So we got a second buffalo in the box. It does have all four legs. That leg does look kind of weird though. We got another reverse Denver. It's 1963. We got 1966 Philadelphia. It looks to be in pretty good condition too. We got 1964. To 1964 Philadelphia. I thought it was at San Francisco for a second. Then we got a 1954 Denver. We got another reverse Denver. It's a 1958. This is a reverse Denver and it's in really good condition. Oh, it's a 1964 though, so that's not going to be an upgrade. Is that silver? I doubt it actually. Nope, it's just damage. It's a 2011. A 2011 damage like that? That's kind of weird. We got two 1964s. And they're both Denver. This one is a reverse Denver. It's scratched, though. It's a 1964. Ooh, what's this? Kind of gold plated. Let's see what this one is. It's a 1970 San Francisco. We got 1960 Philadelphia. We got 1962 Philadelphia. We got a reverse Denver. That's 1963. Oh, there's probably not going to be anything in here. This is probably going to be something though. It's a 1940. We got a coin from the 40s in this roll. We got a 1964 Philadelphia. We got a 1970 San Francisco. We got a 1964 Denver. We got a 1959 Denver. It looks like we got two older coins in a row. This one, it's a 1964, and this one is a reverse Denver, and it's another 1964. I'm hoping for two Canadian nickels, because that's how many I need to finish my mystery boxes with Canadians. We got a 1949, that might be one that we don't have yet. We got a reverse Denver, and it's a 1949. 
It's a 1964. We got a 1964 Denver. We got a 1963 Philadelphia. We got a 1968 Denver. We got a 1964 Denver. And we got another 1964 Philadelphia.